hello in this uh, aws uh, developing uh, associate uh, knowledge series we are doing this uh, module 4 okay so i welcome you for this uh, knowledge check with module 4 so yeah this knowledge check is very important for preparing for your uh, aws developer associates uh, examination we have about 10 questions where we need to uh, answer these 10 questions at least 7 70 percent of correct okay so let us uh, start this uh, module 4 see here on my screen the first question which option uh, is the amazon aws uh, customer responsible for under aws shared responsibility select 2 uh, it is the cloud client side data is completely customer responsibility and also uh, security group configuration is also customer responsibility okay yeah this is correct and the second one which aws iam resource explicitly grants or denies permission to a user or group of users it is policies yeah this is correct the third one which is the correct term for the process of verifying a user's identity as a developer it's called as authentication so yes authentication is the correct one the fourth one which statement about iam user authentication are true select two so here uh, i can say aws credentials to authenticate with any supported servers must be provided yes i take this and also a username and password to authenticate to the console must be provided yes this is correct the fifth one which suggestion is an aws recommendation for securing aws credentials for applications that run on amazon ec2 that is amazon compute cloud instances so this is a uh, create uh, I can say this is a create a role uh, okay create an Amazon uh, AWS uh, identity IAM role and attach to the EC2 instance yes this is the way okay the sixth one what is the format of AWS IAM policies that define the allowable APIs uh, uh, calls an entity can invoke it is JSON javascript object notation the sixth one yes this is correct seventh one an administrator created an aws iam uh, group called managers within an aws account a dash policy uh, is attached to the managers group it allows managers to read uh, from and write to amazon s3 bucket in the same aws account what is the type of policy it is uh, identity based policy absolutely correct yeah eighth one which statement reflects the best practices when granting permissions to users groups roles and resources uh, this is a question which is very very important create policies that follow the the principles of least goodness. okay ninth one so what is the effect of policy uh, statement you see here this is deny of dynamo db and not resource so you can say uh, denies actions on dynamo db yeah or amazon s3 resource except the resources that are listed not yeah this should be the correct one yep and the last one which statements are true about valuation logic for aws iam policies select two so all okay you cannot have deny and allow statements in the same policy okay an explicit allow uh, no explicit deny overrides yes this is correct and by default all requests are denied yes this is the one this is the one okay let me check yes this is correct so this completes our module 4 and congratulations we have completed with 100% Okay, let us again meet in module 5. Thank you and bye.